dispatch from the Ravencroft Institute. Can anyone respond? Over. Dispatch, we got our hands full with the Blackout and Oscorp. Cannot respond. Repeat, cannot respond. <sighs> I better get over there now. The sad part is, I can't put any of this on my resume. There's a riot at Ravencroft. We don't have the manpower to handle it. All we could do is close the bridge, seal it off. What about the people who work there? We sent us some task force guys to evacuate, but they're having a bad time. Any chance you can lend a hand? On my way. This is a nightmare. How'd it get so bad so fast? It's like someone deliberately freed all the most dangerous inmates. This is worse than I ever imagined. Both the staff and the non-violent inmates are in a bad spot. Get those people out. They say everyone's the hero of his own story. Eh, but come on, I'm <laughs> I'm on to you. Time for some tough love. You are really bad at this. Here's one for the highlight reel. We'll evacuate anyone who's not involved in the riot. I call this the seismic blast. You can call it lights out. You want to go into another line of work, huh? Spider-Man! Get me out of here! Thank you. It got so bad so fast. Glad to help. Now get as far away from here as you can. Scared. Head for the bridge. The police will get you out. I still get butterflies. Police brutality? You don't know the meaning of the word. Yes.
how to evacuate anyone who's not involved Thanks, in the riot. brother. I mean that. Don't thank me yet. You need to get to safety. against you. What happened here? It was... Cassidy. We tried treating him with an experiment. You don't! I know what you and Fisk were up to. Using these people as guinea pigs. Okay, fine, fine. But the danger's real. Cassidy changed into something horrible. Deadly. And he wants to make more like him. I'll get you outside, which is more than you deserve. But then I have to go after Cassidy. I agree. He's headed for the sub-basements, where the most damaged inmates are kept. Now, if he makes them into beings like him, no place will be safe. Oh. from here. My car's outside. Get to a hospital. Tell the police everything. Or after I'm done with Cassidy, I'll come looking for you. Duty security. I wonder what they had here. I had a feeling something seriously wrong was going on here. How is that? That water's got a live current. It. Stay on high ground.
bionic webbing. Sorry, it's just fun to say that. This isn't personal, I just think you're a jerk. Okay, maybe it is personal. pictures of me winning like this. Burn marks? I bet this is where they held Max Dillon. Stay out of that water, or I'm gonna get one heck of a jolt. <laughs> Venom Project? Huh, great. Why is it never the Puppy Project or the Chocolate Project? Huh. Gotta stop Cassidy before he makes things even worse. Anything. I've never seen anything so horrible in my life. I have a 
growing families. So now it's to feed. I think I'll feed them. That is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. My friend is hungry. It wants a nice fat spider punch on. You rejected my gift. But I have another one for you. Death. All the voices in my head agree. You have to die. We've gotta stop Cassidy before he makes things even worse. Turn my back on people in need. Cassidy! That's as far as you go! One of you is already too many! I'm not Cletus Cassidy. Not anymore. I'm my true self now. I'm... Carnage! Butterflies when I fight the bad guys. Poor little spider. You're just not ready to see the truth, are you? I didn't web up your mouth because I don't want you to suffocate. But you're starting to talk me out of it. See, you think you're joking. But I know what you won't admit to yourself. When I killed those criminals, you were happy. You were grateful to me, weren't you? No, I... It's not too late to understand. I'll tell you whatever you want to know. Here's the real difference between us, Spider-Man. I'm at peace with who I am. You shouldn't be. And you should? Then why aren't you? Sorry, Cletus. I just figured out talking to a psycho killer isn't gonna give me the answers I'm after. I know what will. Death!
get busted for smoking in public. Oh, yeah. It's gonna get a lot bloodier than that.
It's not the answer, Cletus. None of us are gonna find any answers here. What's the matter, Peter? You look like you lost your last friend. Hey, but I know for a fact you've still got at least one. It's Uncle Ben. I miss him so much. I just feel... lost without him. He raised me. I loved him. And he died because he was looking for me. I'm not sure how to live with that. Let me ask you something, Pilgrim. Your Uncle Ben, he was one of the best people I ever knew. Everyone loved him. He had an amazing life, right? So, why do you want to make it all about how it ended? What counts isn't how he died, Peter. What matters is really the way he lived. I, I want you to make his life mean something. I want you to be the man he raised you to be. The man that he was so proud of when he saw what you were growing into. He told you that? All the time. Your uncle knew what a tough place the world could be. He knew that it needs heroes. And hey, take it from me, you are one of those heroes. So what do you say? Are you gonna go out there and prove it? I want you to do it for Uncle Ben, and for me. Yeah. Yes, Dan. I will. I miss Uncle Ben. I'll always miss him. But I don't have to replace him, because he already gave me everything I needed. Now it's up to me to honor his memory by using what he gave me, in a way that'll make him proud. Nuff said. Nuff said.
Oh, you can rely on me, Mr. Mayor. <laughs> I consider it my honor to provide any help I can. What happened to young Osborne is tragic. But never fear. I'll continue to finance the task force myself. And, at the risk of seeming overconfident, I promise you, with the criminal organizations that plagued our city crushed, the crime rate will go down to a manageable level. Yeah, goodbye. There you are. Come in, my friend. Come in. I couldn't have done this without you. Chameleon. What happens now? Now, the real work begins.